Okay, it wasn't quite as dramatic as last week, but again, you had to work hard for the win today, didn't you? Yeah, we always seem to do that to ourselves, to be fair, but um, we bounced back really well from last week. Our performance today was loads better than it was. Um, obviously, a bit of a sloppy start in the second half, but we actually did play really well today um, as a team and everything. Game management towards the end as well was really good. So, yeah, lots of positives today. Just a little slight bit of frustration you couldn't quite kill a game off? Um, yeah, a little bit. We did have quite a lot of chances that we you know, we should have put away, but at the end of the day, we work hard together um, all the way to the end, no matter what the score is, and we just battle on. So, yeah. Sophie, the important thing is you're grinding out victories, aren't you? Even if it's by the odd goal, and, and that's a sign of a good winning team, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think we've been by far the better team um, in, in the last couple of weeks. We just, like Kelly said, we, we just need to take our chances and maybe a bit more secure at the back, like my fault for the goal in the first game. <laughs> I wasn't going to ask you that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, I think um, today was much better than last week. Um, hopefully we can push on, maybe even do a bit better next week. In a strange way, last week's game, in a way, sort of did you good the fact that you, you got the win seeming you were going to lose with two minutes to go? Yeah, it's definitely a, a confidence boost that we got that last minute wonder goal by Kelly Warren. Because, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it's given us a real spur on because we might have been a bit down leading into today's game. But, um, yeah, I think we're doing all right. I'm quite pleased with today's result. Um, bring on Bournemouth next week. <laughs> I suppose, Katie, a little relief that you didn't have to go up and score a winner for them this week. The forwards <laughs> did their job this time. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Um, anyone scores, you know, yeah. it's a team game at the end of the day. So, yeah, please for anyone who scores and gets on the score sheet. But obviously, good that I managed to get there last week so we could um, score three points in the last minute. I was only kidding, don't worry. But, <laughs> <laughs> but is it looking forward to the next round in the Cup, presumably you'll, you'll want a home draw. You, you come out to this region of the world... Mm -hmm. Three weeks running now, so a bit of home comfort, I suppose. Would I know, yeah, that would be quite decent, actually. We've been away in the same journey, same time for the last three weeks, which is a long journey. But, um, yeah, so it'd be good to go, you know, get a home draw in the next round. That'd be quite good, yeah. Anyone in particular? Some, somebody different, perhaps, from this thing? Liverpool Feds would be nice, wouldn't they? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't see that one go. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, Liverpool Feds would be good. Um, obviously, a decent team um, with Fran and everything, so that'd be really good, yeah, to have at home. So, yeah. We don't know at the moment whether... Southampton Saints have got through her yet or not, but uh, you're not looking for a Southampton derby at all then? No, we'll have them at a later date in the final yeah, of another cup. In the <laughs> <laughs> we have them in the league. <laughs> so, no, yeah, Liverpool Feds would be a good one. Well, Sophie, overall, it's another game, another win. You're still winning all the time. Yeah. As you said before, winning breeds confidence, and you're still in there with the fight, aren't you? People are talking about Plymouth and Cainsham all the time, but you're still in there. Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, um, haven't, we've unbeaten in the league. Six out of six. Um, six out of six. Yeah. Um, we've got Kenshin coming up, which is going to be an important game. Um, we'll have to win that one to have a start, a chance of winning the league. Um, but we're confident that we've got a chance. We should do this. We can do this. In a way, is it, is it taking the pressure off you a little bit? The fact that you've been a few games behind, you started late because the game's been called off, and the fact that you, you've gone under the radar a little bit because of that? Um, I'm happy to do that. We can be the underdog. <laughs> um, yeah, I bet it's a good thing. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, it is We love good. an underdog. Yeah, yeah. We're just going to sneak on up there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're um, confident that there's a very good chance we can win the league this season. Plymouth is going to be the most important game. Um, we'll work be, hard. Yeah, so we're going to work hard to, to beat them. I think we can, we can maybe do it. And Kenny, the team's come a long way in a very short space of time. He's been winning, 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 winning titles over the last couple of years. Do you think that's the sort of thing that stands you good stead, stepping up to a higher level? Oh, 100%, yeah. And the morale in the team is really high at the moment. So um, we're all working really well together. Um, so yeah, all the wins are really good to get them under the belt and confidence boosting, so it's good. You've got a lot of experienced players in the team, players who have played at a higher level. I have to ask about Kirsty Bell. She is, she's still playing as well as ever, isn't she? <laughs> Yeah, she's a decent player. Yeah, it's good to have obviously the experience in the team as well. So it helps with the you know the younger ones that are coming through. But everyone's pulling their weight, and we're all doing really well together. So and goals coming from all over the team. Jane Yates getting on the score sheet today as well. Yeah, yeah, nice little goals. <laughs> Couple from Jack. Happy days. Yeah. <laughs> Happy days indeed. Well done today, well done on another good win. Congratulations on a very good start to the season for Southampton. We wish you the very best of luck from here for the rest of the season. And no doubt we'll see you again before the end of the yeah. season. Thanks for taking the time and coming and talking to us in the cold here. As I said, we wish you the very best of luck. I hope you get the draw you want in the next round, Liverpool Feds. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Thank Thanks, guys. Thanks a lot. Thank Cheers. You.